morning, Borderland. Welcome to another hour of news. Today is Friday, August 2nd. I'm Carla Drexler. And I'm Ian Roth. Welcome back or welcome in. If you're just joining us here at this 630 half hour, lots to get to. Absolutely jam packed half hour. We're going to go live to Paris. We're making Crepes. crepes in crepes. just a little bit. It's going to be great. Our friends from the Texas Culinary Institute are literally right over there waiting for us. I, I can't wait. wait. All right, let's take a look at the weather though. First, before we get to do any of that fun stuff, we got to take care of some business first. It's going to be a hot one today, folks. 105 is on the menu today. Whoa. It's going to be uh, potentially another scorcher. Uh, we've seen uh, the, the potential, I should say. Mm -hmm. We haven't actually reached triple digits every day, but it's definitely been the potential to get there uh, every day so far to end this week mm -hmm. and going into next weekend and then into the beginning of next week. Exactly. If you take a look at your nine day forecast there, tomorrow and Sunday are going to be really hot, very much summer like hot and dry. We're not expecting any rain chances. 103, 102 degrees. Mm -hmm. Then on Monday, some rain chances return again. We got some showers in the evening there, but we're still sticking with those triple digits Tuesday 101 Wednesday 101 again those showers come back next week but you know how those things can always yeah. change today we might be expecting some late night showers but according to our radar it is not looking too promising but don't be surprised if you see a couple of drops let's send it over now to our Jasmine Perry before that golf Phoenix for today is at an eight you can most definitely play golf but our Jasmine's going to tell us <laughs> what is going to be happening on the roadway 